All right, welcome back, everyone. So we are on episode three now of John Rurikson and Eric the Slayer's epic adventure to become adventurers and heroes with Skyrim. Yesterday, we just got some epic new armor, which we are both wearing, full steel, which, you know, it's a good way to start. We're here outside the Companions. We still have all of our items, the loot that we got from Ember's Hard Mind to process. So we're gonna work on that. Uh, today's the 26th in game, so the following day is going to be the Harvest Festival. And I'd like to try and take on Halted Stream Camp uh, tomorrow in game. That should give us a, a little bit more XP. Here we go. Awesome. Oh, awesome. AJ claimed our, our Viking helmet to wear while we stream, so there we go. Very nice. Extra epic, right? Yep, this is a street, a, uh, a redemption that we have for the live stream is that if you want, there's a bunch of different hats that you can make me wear while we go live. Because why not? So, awesome, AJ. Thank you very much for claiming that. So, Eric, First, I thought I'd miss one. I'm gonna need Oops. back all of the ridiculous stuff that you have. He can keep most of that. Uh, why does he have two steel helmets, though? In a minute. Let me know if. Where's all of our uh, smithing stuff? Did I? I must have put it all back in that barrel, right? I bet that is exactly what I did. Meantime, though, what we can do is we can drop off all of our crabs here and get these processed. Yeah, I think I left them down over there. That must have been what I did. Yes, are you sitting? Don't sit on our crabs, bro. All right, that's that's fine. Let's see how long it takes to process these. About an hour per, that's not too bad. We're really just gonna be harvesting the ingredients out of these, so. Oh, okay, that took an hour and a half. So it's already nine. We can probably clean and dispose of like four. We're clean and harvest one more, then we'll be headed to bed. We re, ah! <laughs> Hey, okay. Harvesting skills improved. One thing we could do... No, it's raining. We're gonna sleep inside. Um, Eric should have our new tent. Right? Eric's standing in the rain. Yeah, here's our, our large fur tent, which is good enough for three people. So we could get an extra follower if we really want to have the supplies for it. Let me know if there's anything else you need. And I think what we'll take this is we're just going to drag it out of the rain here. And we'll keep it right here. We'll process it tomorrow, right? We might have a little bit of extra time because we're going to go in the morning to take out all the stream camp. And if we have extra time, then we will butcher that crap. So then, we got everything we need. For. I mean, I guess we could get the meat if we really I don't see any purpose for that. Anything else we need from inside? I don't think there's anything we can take. We might be able to find another quest. I don't believe, yeah, talk to the companions for work, right? So we can try and take up a companion's line. If I, the, uh, the reason that we didn't take another quest from them was because it ended up being like Silent Moon's camp or just something that was way above our pay grade. So we can go up top and ask Ayala for like an animal hunt. That's, that should be a little bit more reasonable. I think she assigns one within Skyrim. Come to me with questions. I know uh, our history no. almost as well as Vignar by now. Let's see if I can find her. <laughs> Probably outside. We'll have to get back our uh, beef stew and all the other buffs. Where is she? Oh, where is she? We might just have to worry about that later. I can't find her. It, well, it would be nice to find her because I'd like to get some other alchemy training too. Very quickly, we'll see. Skior says that I have the strength of Isgr. We've gotten a letter about. I don't know what the fight is about. I just need you to go out. No oh, we can. That. There I we go. We can just beat the crap out of someone. Get to it then. 
job we can take on. Who's it gonna be? Oh, the mage! We get to go be- Oh, okay. That's something I'm supposed to deliver. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Oh, this should be about our silver sword, right? The silver great sword. Yes. All right. Here we'll open this up, right? So we have some some fishing areas, like three of them. We'll get into that later, and we'll just learn that book. Even though I don't think I'm ever going to use clairvoyance as a spell. So, Varengar the Mage, right? I'm wearing heavy armor. I really don't think I'm even going to need to, to essentially break a sweat doing this, right? I mean, I won't sprint up there just to make sure that I have full, or early semi-full stamina. But how difficult could this be, really? I mean, we're going to beat up a mage, so... What, what could possibly go wrong? Thank goodness he isn't allowed to use any magic on us because, like, one fireball and we would just be, like... <laughs> that would be that. I do want to make sure that we are actually doing the, uh... He is up here, right? Yeah, okay. There aren't any other mages, right? Beating up the court wizard. What we'll do is, do we have any food? Yeah, we have all these apples, which aren't going to do much, but... Oh, well, they restored a little bit, right? Uh, a survival skill level has gone up a little bit, so... From, from apples. How thirsty are we? Oh, we're, like, parched. Oof. Yeah, let's fix that. Do we have any water? And excellent. Divine smile on you. Yeah, well. Oh, that's interesting. He doesn't have a dialogue option. Come on. Oh my god, he's level 50. Luckily, he's pretty weak, but he's level 50. What the hell, man? It's terrifying. I didn't know he was such a high level. Like I said, if he didn't really want to, he could have just freaking tougher than you look. You got me, fair and square. Oh. You you know what you have to do. Fine, I'll take care of it. Just please leave me alone. Ugh. I think what we're gonna do is we will stop down by the Shrine of RK. We'll get healed. We'll rebuff our RK's prayer. Right here, can we make the jump? Oh, I, I, well, I, I failed the jump, technically, but. <sighs> Do we have any stew on us? Oh, wrong, uh, wrong interface there. We have beef stew. Okay, we have a horker stew. But the horker stew is what? I think it's for. What's well, 1800 seconds? It's like 30 minutes, right? So, yeah, we, we should be okay with just that. What we'll probably end up doing, though, is going and doing the combat pretty much immediately, and then we'll come back and we'll deal with all of the, you know, the loot and crafting armor and selling everything. That'll be the plan. First, we'll heal up, take our stews, take our medicine, right? Ah, good to see. Please heal my wounds. Of course. It was a pleasure. Nice. And then, how long is our uh, buff here? Six, six hours, sixteen minutes. And then, when we refresh, goes up to eight hours. So yeah, I mean, I guess it was worth it. But you really only have to pray at it once per. Uh, Basically, once every, like, three days or so. So, we'll do one of these. And we'll run on through. Do we have anything that we had to sell? For general goods? I think so. 
I guess, yeah, we have all of these cloaks that we should sell. That's right, Belathor's store was closed. It's a little strange. Belathor gives you kind of a crappy deal, so instead we're going to go to the maid shop, which is right over there. I could probably turn in the other quests that we have for the brawl, in case Ayala has an animal hunt for us that's in the direction of Halted Stream Camp, but... Probably won't have to worry about Take that. Look. Oh yeah, here we go. The Staff of Courage. I mean, take the gold. Rather have the gold. We don't need that many of those. I'm going to hold on to this thing because of how amazing it is. The Expert Illusion robes here, we might be able to give to a follower. They're not that heavy. I mean, they only have a weight of two. So instead, what we're going to do is we're going to sell these one at a time. Helps get the speech level up a little bit faster. And we're going to hold on to that in case we, we really need it. Get rid of that. That. That either. We might get into magic. We'll hold on to that. Mm -hmm. And we have to pick up our silver sword, too. Can't forget that. If I say we pick up the silver sword and let's go do some combat. Oh, I hope it isn't some How's ridiculous price. I'd like to pick up my order. Is it ready? Of course. Uh, don't be too expensive. Yeah, okay. It's not too bad, right? It's 400 gold. I don't know how much it would have been by itself, right? Pretty good. Yeah. All right, I want to grab a few more orcish arrows because she doesn't Take seem to have an overwhelming abundance of them. She hasn't even restocked. Okay. Ooh. Alchemy increased by 9%. Now we're a heavy armor character. All right, luck out there. time to go. Time to go. I'll just stream camp and beat everybody up. There it is. Stream camp. All we need now is one Eric. There you are. It just feels right somehow. What do you need? Huh. Hmm. Hmm. Well, that's interesting. Yeah, we'll just get, leave him with a normal bow, because his can't break, I don't think. Ours can, so we need the extra one. We're also... We'll we'll keep this, because we can just kind of stroll around town. If, if, if we ever have to take off of our, our armor, which actually we do, let's do very quickly... Oh, I was like, what just happened? Um... I panicked a little bit there because I was handing him the gear. The coin always greases the wheels. Oh, hold on. There we go. Switch over to these, and I'm going to give him and us. I think I even hotkeyed these. Um, so we'll do one on target first, because oh, that takes like all of our magicka. Did. Did it hit him? I didn't see any effects. Was I too far away? That isn't good. Luckily, with these robes, our, our uh, magic ever generates faster. So that's one of the reasons I want to keep them, right? There we go. That's what I really wanted, is to get one on him. We can do one for us later. But now if he's ever knocked down in combat with that healing aura, he'll get back up significantly fast. Switch back into armor. Oh, there we go. Yeah, I have an extra helmet on me. All right, Eric. We don't have any scrolls, but that's okay. See if we can get a uh, sneak shot in here. Drag. Oh, who sees me? I 
I can't freaking s oh 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 detecting me no I think they're gonna come this way so we just try and go for it aim a little bit high What is- what in the hell is happening over there? Oh, okay. Eric says we're in combat. <laughs> what the- it must be a saber cat or something. Well, that's what you're coming in on, huh? Ah. Shot me with that arrow. Oh my god, it's freaking... Ah! I think it's because I don't have my third armor for... For heavy armor. But I can't run while swinging. Did... Did they just clear the whole freaking camp for us? They did all the work for us! I don't know what to say! Uh, I don't know, okay. There might be one guy left up top, though. No? Alright. Damn. Well, that was easy. Oh, there's, uh... Move along. Oh, okay. <laughs> I couldn't tell if that was a bandit or not. Okay, great. So, it looks like they took out a bunch of people over here. Let's see if we can find them. It was... what? What's, uh... Survival, right? Alt, right? You see anyone? Yeah, it looks like there's one up there and one up there. Holy crap. Did all the work for us. And then... Where was it? Right here? Yeah, three of them. Break all this down. They didn't even use their scrolls. This is great. Steel, eh. We'll take that, though. It just feels right somehow. You... What do you want me to carry? Sir? Uh... Get an upgrade to that. Anything else? Hmm. Let's see if he wants a steel, steel sword instead, but. Let me know if you need anything. Come on. Here we go. We'll break down anything made out of iron. The iron battle axe. Uh, the storm cloak helmet. A lot of the steel stuff, though, we'll probably end up keeping. And anything like the fur shoes, or... Anything with fur in the name, we're gonna break down. But the cloaks we can sell. We can definitely sell, right? The light equipment... Oh, here. The, uh... Tunic there will break down for leather, too. At first, I thought I'd miss... What do you need? I need you... To... Carry... All this junk. <laughs> Down those. All the deer pelts spawning in my inventory. <laughs> I'd rather have him using one-handed equipment. I feel like there's just something eating up my inventory. Probably these aren't helping. What is it? Am I missing something? That up. What else is so heavy that I don't seem to be seeing? Maybe it really is the, uh, all these. You know what I can do is, is disable a few of these because we don't really need the, um, right, like the armor and the base armor or the coverage. Total weight. These don't really make sense. All right, that'll help a little bit. 
Yeah, that's a good start. Is there anything else you need? I'm a little bit... Yeah, see, we can't sprint and swing at the same time. Hey, Guffy, what's up? How are you doing? Thank you for joining us. I'm trying to learn how to play Wildlander, apparently. But the fact that we can't swing and sprint is uh, definitely throwing me off a little bit. Go for a salmon steak, but... It would be all that helpful. What else? Need any firewood? We cut our own. Uh, let's see if there's any bodies around here that. Do you no. Know? That was all of them. Oh, that was just some flowers. Yep. So we'll take these. Oh, okay. Accidentally did the wrong trap. I'll take a step back. I would have preferred to get the XP, but... Huh. Ooh. That would have... It's it's empty? A freaking empty chest? Well, That's okay. Now I'm... <laughs> now I'm actually okay with the fact that I didn't spend too much time on it. Goodness, hey, garlic. That's decently expensive. Any other food items that we should grab? Nah. No, it looks like we've cleared the outside pretty well. And and then the inside's pretty simple, right? I mean, you have the, that one guy standing guard, and then you just kind of do the, uh... Pop the lanterns up top, right? Try not to trigger the trap here. What was that? Huh? Come on! Time to end this little game. Ah! Oh! Interrupted me. He's cake. Uh, we'll take all of his stuff later. Instead, I wonder if we'd be able to carry out all of the mammoth tusks and stuff. Be nice. What's this? Just iron. We we tried mining all of the iron in order to get uh, gems. That was successful. I mean, I could try again, but... It... It's not that it wasn't successful, it's that it just was... It wasn't very enjoyable either. It, it took forever, so... I think we'll be avoiding it. It's not worth it. We'll, uh, we'll punch people in the face to get our gems. Hey, look at that. And let's see, which of these is the best, right? Probably the high grade one. I don't think I like where this is going. Ah crap. Looks like we got ourselves a hero. I don't think that was uh exceptionally successful. Oh. Whoa! Fireballs? Wow. Eric, you okay? Freaking staff of fireballs? We might keep that one. Let's take all of that. What else we got here? Yeah, all the scrap, we're gonna break it down. Oh, the poacher's axe, nice. Three points of extra damage to animals. There we go. Nice job, Eric. Okay, we'll search him first. Ooh, we can give this to Eric. Nordic gauntlets. That is a significant improvement to what we're wearing. Orcish boots and an orcish chest. What the heck? I was loaded. Wow. Nice cloak, too. I don't think we're really gonna eat any horse meat, but yeah, here it is. Fireball for 50 damage, 600 gold. And then, uh, yeah, we'll sanctify him. 
Nice. Favor went up 3%, and I am super over-encumbered. Eric is healing. We will give... We're going to put on all of that. We still have a steel helmet, but that's okay. Dang. Oh, that's not what I wanted. I wanted to go like this. Look at that. It just feels right somehow. We can give Eric all of our old steel armor and see what he wants to keep, but... Give him all the iron stuff too. We'll we'll deal with all you know breaking all of this down. Back. Let's give it to him for now. What else? The I don't want to give him the staff of fireball. So he'll freaking kill us with it, right? Like we'll give him this too, and he's probably gonna start using it. No, he prefers the great sword, huh? Well, no, you are a one-handed bro. What happened with my chat? I'm sorry. One moment here. Strange. Um, nice. Lead still, on. still First barely over encumbered. Hold on. What do you want me to carry? Everything, Eric. I want you to carry everything. Boots. <laughs> Had five of those. I could give him all the skooma, but I don't trust him. Let's see how much all of this weighed. This that was a good like ten. Iron ingots. Yeah, I don't know what's weighing us down so much. Might be all of the heavy armor. <laughs> or or the multitude, you know, Is there anything else you multiple need? weapons that we have, right? We're just going to break this down. That'll help a little bit. So what do we got? A couple potions, mostly mead. There, there was a bunch of stuff on. Hey, there it is. Scaled armor's book. That should sell for 300 gold. Uh, yeah, this should be fine, right? What are the chances those fall and kill us? Let's see, so there's a... Ah, no, that's not what I wanted. Anything here? Nah, but we'll we'll take all of those last. They're heavy and difficult to work with. This make quick quick work of all the looting here, right? Oh, more. Not bad. Fifty gold. Take it. Thing no. Oh, we get to see what's in there. We're gonna do that one last. All right, we're gonna build up to it. Run fan. Greater potion. Eh, I don't know if I should have taken that. Ooh. Home of knock. Let's see, a couple of fortify, iron, leather boots. I think I'm gonna take the leather boots. What was that? Fortify smithing. We're gonna try going outside and taking what's out there. Is there anything uh, important here? Can we, I think we will. I think if we take this mammoth meat, we can turn this into our own recovery stews. And that will definitely be worth it. The only thing I'm gonna do, try and get Eric over here. Snip this, so that we don't accidentally trigger it. And by we, I mean me, mostly. I'm also gonna try not to die on the spikes, right? But he's gonna die on the spikes. Okay. Ooh, we got an onyx out of that. All right, we're gonna drag the people. We don't accidentally trip on them here. I 
I could pick up the deer and bring it in. I am not even gonna try to do that. Like, I've died so many times on these spikes. And I think Eric's looking at them and just like, nope, right? I don't wanna get tetanus or ligma or nothing off of those spikes. Just not worth it. The only other thing is, uh, oh look, it already triggered, but I just want to make sure that was actually triggered and not a visual bug, right? Oh, did we just freaking, oh no, it's just Eric. Okay, I was like, are we resetting it? Nope, it's just Eric being awesome. All right, last but not least, the true, the true yield, okay. Amulet of Kinnereth, we'll probably start wearing that. Three Paradots. Oh, okay, cooking pots. Decent poison there. Pretty good, right? Oh, that's pretty nice. Not bad, right? Miscellaneous stuff here. We'll take what we want. Uh, so we'll take all the potions, we'll take the gold and that. I don't really need any, any other stuff there, but... Not bad, not bad. Anything in there? Anything in here? No. You could take the sword and break it down. I don't think it's really good. However, we're definitely going to be taking all of the mammoth meat, which seems like a strange thing to take, but it just feels right. We we have so such a big problem with getting like high quality meat and food yeah. items out of the um the word I'm looking for, white run, that we're we're just bringing back this hall, right? It's poached. We're taking it anyway. First, I thought I'd miss. No problem. How can I help? We're taking all these too. Are they mammoth tusks? Barely underweight. So let me see if there's anything I can Eric. help with. We can read that spell book. Knock. Novice lock. Knock rank one. Yeah, oh, we'll read that. We're a little slow, right? You can feel it because we're almost over encumbered. But otherwise, I think that's it. Very nice. The beginning was a little messy, but otherwise. Mostly clean. Mostly. We'll take these ones. Oops. Mammoth. Oh, it's the edible, right? 125 stamina. This new armor fits. Can you even imagine what a mammoth snout must taste like, though? Probably not super pleasant. I mean, that's my assumption, but I. Lockpick there. All right, avoid that. That would have been a catastrophe if we ended uh, Halted Stream Camp by just a freaking pile of rocks. Rocks fall, everyone dies, right? That's the stream. <laughs> the end. Uh. Nope, and we will run over to the east. Oh yeah, okay, don't fall in there. Let's see what's up at the watchtower. Get a few more level ups from Ayla and then we'll call it a day. We won't do any smithing today. I'll probably do that off camera, right? I'll I'll deal with all of the, uh, the miscellaneous inventory management. How are we for our buffs? About 15 more minutes. Uh, let's put up a healing poultice good to have. Should have done that after we were out of combat. We could head over to a few more waypoints. I think instead we'll just head over to the watchtower straight here. See if there's any fun happening. Sometimes there is. Ah! 
Whoa! Oh crap, oh crap, oh crap! Yeah, don't worry, guards. I took care of everything for you. Goodness. Salmon steak? Nah. We have, we're... We're almost okay. Start with this one, because it's more difficult to see. Yeah, we'll take all that. And... Anything else here? Yep. Anything except the one. I think we can just quickly... Oh my goodness. Break down as much of the iron and stuff as we can. I don't want to break down any of the steel, though. Iron is just not worth carrying around like this, right? Wow! I freaking 64 lockpicks. Not bad. The rest of it, it just we'll just hand right. over. What do you need? Steel weapons. All of the light leather stuff here. Those. Uh, ooh. We're gonna upgrade to a brown bear cloak. Look at that. So fancy. Now that we're in the light, we can take a look at what we're <laughs> the helmet, our steel helmet looks out of place with all of the uh, the other advanced gear that we have now. It's pretty funny, actually. I am still over encumbered. At first, oh. I thought I'd miss. What do you want me to carry? Oh, you know why? It's because we still have all these fragments. And uh, silver ore. I guess we can sell that. Fine. If there's any way I can be of service, please let me. So the last thing that we will do is we'll help Cicero get some quick gold, get the weird, creepy elf man off the road. I know he's not an elf, but what race is Cicero? Hi, how you doing? Hope your day has been well. We're gonna help a jester not murder people. Uh, we actually don't even have to talk to him. We can just run right up to Lorien Farm and start the quest from there. It's usually the best way to do it. Glorious, excuse me. Hello! Oh, for the love of Mara, what now? What's up? Is something wrong? Or maybe you missed the demented little man in the jester's garb down by... Crazy no, we saw him. Me to fix his broken wagon wheel five times. What's the problem? Pay me! You think this is about money? Have you seen the man? And he's transporting some giant box. You could have anything in there. War contraband, weapons, skooma. Ain't no way I'm getting involved in any of that. Well, you should help what? him, though. And just who in Mara's name are you, anyway? Hmm? Come. Now help him. Look, I... Do it. I Do it. Do it. Right. Help, help the man. Fella might be nutters. Might not. But fact is, he needs help. I turned him away. <laughs> what kind of a... Look, um, thanks. And I'm sorry for my unneighborly reaction. No, it's okay. I'll go tell him. I try my best when I'm going through dialogue options like that to, to make them a little bit smoother instead of just, you know, jamming through them. My goal is so that people who aren't familiar with Skyrim will be able to follow along, you know, slightly. But... I don't think I've ever seen Cicero with a beard. He looks really weird. I am gonna have to talk to Dylan about that because hasn't Cicero always been clean shaven in the vanilla game? <laughs> you, you did. He has. He's still terrifying though, looking at his eyes. Here, here for your troubles. Gold. Thanks, Cicero. For your kind deed. And thank you. Thank you again. <laughs> I don't see any bodies. It looks like he just has an iron fork in there. We could also steal his horse if we really wanted to, right? We really wanted to. Oh, we need some butterflies. 
So, we'll head on back into town. And, uh, the, I think the har I don't know what time the Harvest Festival starts, but... Alright, we are back, and what we're gonna do now is harvest that crab that we have over there. But first, what I'd like to do I've heard you is may get some you quick levels in training, because it's gonna cost us probably like 600 gold, right? To level us up. Actually, now now that our marksman's a little bit higher, it might be more expensive. Um, should we do one-handed or archery? I, th I think we'll just do I'm archery, doing. right? Yeah, so that took what? Yeah, it was close, around 800 gold. Until next time. And we'll see what level that puts us at. Nice, so we're halfway to level six now. See, excellent. And if we wanted to, we can do training yet again right now, right? Now that we've done a level up. Out with it. Uh, I'll show you what I. We're available for five more levels. See? So we can decide on what those are going to be. In the meantime, where are we going to put our put our perk? Oh, it's too bad that the uh, I, what I have to do is wait for Eric to get injured and then use the uh, healing aura on him instead of a healing poultice, right? We don't need anything for something. Oh, we're so close. <sighs> we might wait for that. I think that's exactly what we're going to do. Is we're going to wait for that perk and put it into heavy armor. So we are going to clean our happy mud crab friend here. Our some ingredients. <clears throat> now I'm over encumbered because we lost our stew buff. It just feels right somehow. I'm at your service. Let's see. Oh, look. Um, something has fixed allowing us, or, or essentially making it so that he is no longer bugged with his inventory, which is probably for the better, right? Interesting. Is there any iron stuff that we can break down? Doesn't look like it. Oh, yeah, these. Just gonna grab all the iron stuff. Smelt this really quickly. I wish I could see what his actual actual inventory is. Let me know if there's anything else you need. And I will show you what my crazy plan is. And oops. Got the gauntlets. Here we'll break this down. And we will see if this works. It's probably not going to work, but we might have just enough. I think Dylan said it so that when these drop, they drop as multiple piles. But we're gonna find out. Oh, and... Oh, we're still barely over encumbered, but what we can do is we can carry these right in front of us, just like that. So if we can find a way to drop five carry weights, we will be all set. So we're going to have to drop something on the ground here. The weight of five. What will it be? I don't know. I'd, rather, I'd prefer it to be one item. Obviously. But I don't know if we have anything heavy. Oh, that works. Yeah. Ta-da! That's how you make it so that you can uh, quickly move heavy items, right? Is that you can pick up and hold one item right in front of you. So, for us, that's something that has a carry weight of 50. Easy peasy. And we'll march this right over to where all of our other crafting supplies are. And then we're going to celebrate. I, I'll try my best. No. At what time they set up for the Harvest Festival? It must be five or six, right? Hey, there's our level up. Look at that. 
What perfect timing that was, right? What We weren't even in combat. So we can throw in our extra perk. We'll just do it right now. We, uh, torpedo our way through here, right? Yep. There's all of our ingots. Okay. Help! All right, one sec. Okay, we're back. I fixed it. That took way longer than I thought it would um, because the weather kept changing. Really weird. But we're back. We're officially back. So now we'll grab Eric. We'll uh, just feels right somehow. process. Sure thing. A few of our. Oh my God! He only has two Orcish arrows. Yep, so we'll grab all of the equipment that he no longer needs. And what we're probably going to do is just dump all of the... All of this into that barrel. Honestly, because tonight's, tonight's kind of a night of celebrating. I'll deal with processing all of this off camera. It's it's gonna take forever, right? All of these, the silver ore. Uh, we'll have him hold those, right? We'll make sure he has a torch too. So I have a carry weight now of uh, 500. Let's get going then. But what we will do is we'll break down a few of the items. Right, so anything made out of iron doesn't have a, uh, a good sell or carry weight, so. It's usually just better. Unless it's an Iron Lantern. We keep our Iron Lanterns. The steel, though, we'll usually sell that. It's pretty good stuff. And we are now no longer over in cover. Excellent. Um, let's wait one hour and see if the Harvest Festival is going on. Is it not? Hey, okay. Nice. Looks like we made it here early for the Harvest Festival. Excellent. So we've did it. We have did it. We have done it. So we've done it. We, we did it. We, uh... We survived another day in Skyrim. We made it to the Harvest Festival. Things are going well. I have a lot of uh, materials to process. All the stuff that we've gotten so far. I'll uh, create kind of a plan that we can do to quickly turn it all into goods that we can sell. See how much gold we end up getting. But that's our stream for today. Thank you so much for hanging out. And... Hope you all have a wonderful day. See you next time in the next episode. I'm not too sure what we're going to be doing, but it's going to be something awesome. I guarantee it.